Welcome to Mr. Mitsubishi YouTube channel that covers a lot of new Outlander stuff. And today we have these beautiful Outlanders in and we'll have a look at the exact difference between fully loaded um, interiors. So this one here, we have GT with uh, regular diamond stitched interior. And this one here, we have GT premium with upgraded two-tone interior. So we'll have a close-up look on exactly the differences so let's start with door panel here as you open the door um first thing you notice is this uh part here is a different color sorry it's raining today so uh gonna be a little bit wet today so uh and then this uh, diamond stitch part right here and this stitching if we look at this door right here diamond stitching pattern everything is one color nothing really pops out right and then if we look at the interior just in general this one kind of blends in all black this one here has um it, it stands a lot of things stand out this part stands out and then this line and then the armrest and the other door so other thing is yeah what stands out the most is this line here so and the, the stitching right there right so we can see how this is uh the two-tone color versus here this part here is all black and then there's just a uh, white stitching right here so that will be the difference between uh gt and gtp so the premium interior upgrade then next one up is the seats so of course they use the uh um orange stitching and then this uh, pattern right here we can see it's stitched in diamond pattern but there's no diamond pattern anywhere else throughout the seat right so they use uh, the orange stitching and this uh, diamond pattern way how they stitch it and also the armrest right here is uh, two-tone now if we look at the uh, regular gt seats they use white stitching and uh, this whole thing here is um, diamond pattern stitched and you don't have this uh, sort of like insert that you had uh, on the uh, premium interior and uh, this part here of course it's black oops I'm leaving the wet marks here and uh, this here is uh, stitched in white so other than that this part here everything is the same let's have a look so this part here everything is the same but these things the stitching actually makes a very very big difference so now let's have a look um, how it looks from uh, uh, a second row now the second row same thing right here so we do have uh this as a as a two-tone thing and then uh right here same thing like in the front seats the diamond stitching pattern but nothing else where we can see this is a really nice option by the way they added on the uh mitsubishi is the uh, sunshade not too applicable today because it's raining too much but uh it'll be nice when the sun is back out so there we go and this one same thing stitched all the way in the diamond pattern but there's no two-tone thing nothing comes out so there we go that's how it looks now we'll have a look also at uh from the second row at the uh the front we'll have a look how it looks and then uh you can make your selection which one you like the best so from you know uh luxurious standpoint i think i like the upgraded interior a little bit better it stands out a little bit more but both options are excellent now let's have a look at the uh second row point of view to the front and here's the gtp or the premium stands for the upgraded interior we can see a lot of things stand out uh, way more right from the bat so you do have this uh door side thing and then this line here and even this uh orange stitching that goes around the uh, top of the panel that stands out a lot more so in terms of visual effect this one definitely gives you a little bit more of a dramatic looks so i like that part a lot so there's a lot of people who don't like it so that's why it's good that mitsubishi offers these options you have either have this uh premium version fully loaded two-tone or you have the regular gt with two color options black and white so everybody can find their own perfect preference so here we are in the regular Outlander uh, GT, the fully loaded version, and we can see how everything blends in with black. You do have this piano glass, um, you know, that stands out alongside with this uh, climate control and right here. So there's a lot of luxurious elements that do stand out in the, uh, this scheme here but uh it definitely more so kind of blends in into one tone so if you don't like necessarily this contrast thing 
uh, then this option is excellent way to go. Still looks really, really good. Full LCD screen, large screen right here, equipped extremely nicely. So there we go. This is how the regular GT will look.